Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today is an exciting video because we are diving into the world of design to celebrate Nirvana's 36th anniversary with a killer t-shirt design. I was recently inspired by a fantastic video that I came across on Kittle YouTube channel and I thought to use Kittle to make my Nirvana t-shirt design. Well, today we're going to use Kittle to craft our own unique Nirvana t-shirt design. So let's get started. First, I'm creating an artboard size to fit my t-shirt design perfectly. For the best results, I prefer to use 15 by 18 inch shiz board of 72 dpi. This is because when you download your final design and change the dpi to 300, you will automatically get the design in 4500 by 5400, as you're going to see later. Alright, the first thing we're going to tackle is the band image. For this design, I have checked Google for a high resolution photo of the band that I can use. You can choose any image, save it to your computer and upload it to Kittle by pressing the upload button. We want to give the photo a grungy stencil effect, so we will use Kittle's image vectorizer with color to do that. You can choose the number of colors you want, and for this image, I'm going to use six colors. By experimenting with different color channels, we can achieve that desired grungy stencil style. It's all about finding the right balance of colors to retain the details while achieving the edgy vibe we are after. So eventually, I settled on a combination of colors consisting of red, light gray, of white and black. To enhance the grunge factor, we're adding a tone mask to the image. You can choose any mask you want from the mask menu, then simply drag the image into the mask and it, and it will be automatically placed inside your chosen mask. By the way, you can sign up to Kittle for free using the link in the description of this video in case you would like to try it out. You can also check my other Kittle videos, videos to understand how you use Kittle and all its features. So after experimenting with various fonts, I settled on a combination of fonts for this design. The first font that I'm using here is called Beat Street Font, which I will use to write the main Nirvana tagline. I also decided to write the letters N and A separately on the different text boxes so that I can increase their sizes separately. Using the right menu, I changed the effect of the word and added slight black shadows to the letters to create separation between the letters and the image behind it. Then I decided to change the mask that I used earlier with the image and use another mask that has more torn edges. I thought this one looks cool. Now after finalizing the main tag and the image I started to add additional text for my design and I used different fonts. I added a couple of famous song names like smells like teen spirit and added the words special edition
I also copied part of the lyrics of one of the songs and pasted it in a text box to fill the bottom part of the design. I also played with a mix of fonts and played with the shadows to add some outline to these fonts. I also added another song name which is called Something in the Way and added the text 36th anniversary using a full font called Six Caps. Finally, using the texture tab, I added a texture to the overall design and lowered the opacity level a little bit to create a more of a grungy look to the overall design. Now, to download our design, simply hide the background from the layers panel first and change the resolution to 300 dpi. Now you can see that the design will be exported in 4500 by 5400 which is the ideal specs used for print-on-demand platforms. You can also use the mock-up feature in Kittle to automatically place your design on a mock-up to see how it is going to look like. You can do that by simply clicking on the mock-up uh, tab and your design will be opened in another window and you can choose the mock-up you want and there you have it our awesome Nirvana 36th anniversary t-shirt design thanks for joining me today don't forget to hit that like button subscribe if you haven't already and leave a comment below telling me about your favorite band and if you like me to do a specific video about any design just let me know until next time keep rocking